Hello, I'm Tenran432, and we're going to be playing some more Mega Man X2. Tenran432X2. Wait, what? And we were about to go to the X Hunter base, but we still need one more item, which is a heart tank in Morphmon stage. So let's go over there. It's at the beginning of the stage, so I didn't bother skipping anything. So we're going to try to not kill that guy, take out the Crystal Hunter, and then we'll freeze him over with Crystal. Extra life! That's all we came here? No. There's a heart tank up there, and that is the last item that we need. Or the last item, I guess. But now let's head to the X Hunter's base and take them down. Because they challenged us. And they have something to do with zero. Oh well. So we're here now. And cool music, by the way. Uh, I'm just dropping down here, go on this platform. It switches every time you jump on it, so be quick about that. And there's instant kill spikes down there. So there are these enemies make up here, and then up here from the first stage, these guys will try to crush you between the walls. Pretty easy, this this first part. Some of them get a little bit harder. Let's keep going up, and we got another one of these wall pressure guys. So you're going to want to stay to the right, and then jump to the left, and then keep going up. And shoot the guy if you want. You don't have to. And then we have some of these tail things. Tight tail. I don't really know what they are. Are they some kind of lizard robot? Oh. Take them out. Keep climbing up. Keep going up. And then there's this guy up here. I think this one just goes straight up. There's no jumping across required. The will just run away. And you can go down there as a choice for a path. Or you can go up here. Try to avoid those claws. Not claws. And then, if you chose to go up here, there will be these guys, the tri-shooter, whatever they're called, and they'll be waiting for you there. And there's the ladder that leads from the other side. So now we're up here, stick to the left, jump to the right a little bit later, and don't get hit into that hole there, because it will kill you. Obviously. So now we're already at the boss for the first X Hunter base, so let's take up the Bubble Splash. Can you guess who the boss is? In like one second. Oh. Oh yeah, it's Violin. You could have guessed his weakness because I already had it out. So Violin is. Is it Violin? Yeah, he's pretty much. He's pretty similar. Although, even. His only difference in this boss fight is that he has those rocks. Or those teleporting blocks there. Um. Just take out the fully charged bubble splash, and he'll be good in a few hits. Just stand right next to him with your bubble splash shield, and then he'll explode. I could have voice acted the <laughs> but it would have sounded like that, so I didn't at all. I didn't even mention the <laughs> but That's the first sex hunter level. Now let's go to the second one, because we still have time three minutes in. <laughs> so here we go. X Hunter stage 2. X2. Mega Man X2. Ten Man 432. X Hunter base 2. Double charge shot. Let's see what else. What else have to do? Um, Wolf Moth has two stages in his boss fight. And um, Mega Man X has two feet. Boots, whatever they are. Nah, I'm just going crazy. Uh, poor junkyard robot thing. All those mixed up, mixed up parts from X1. So you're gonna go down here. As you notice, there's some water platforming, lots of spikes. So you're gonna want to stay on top of this platform here. Jump to the next one. Get down, then go across there. Remember that glitch earlier where I told you that you can double jump on water if you had the air dash. We're not going to do that, but it's an option, I guess. Let's see if I can do it. Right now I'm just waiting for the um, other platform to come down. There we go. Finally. 
Whoa, almost hit that spike there. So you're gonna wanna climb on this side, go to the other side, get on top of it, that was close, and then go across there. Next you're gonna wanna take out the crystal hunter and go across there. So what's over that block so you can use the spin wheel to get past, but it's not worth it, it's just like an extra life or something. And you already made it to the end of the stage, so you really need it. Also, the spin wheel will kill these guys instantly. Fun fact. It'll make the game easier. So, this is the X Hunter 2 stage boss, and it is Surge's, but it's a different take on the first boss. So, earlier, when Surge's was in his little hovercraft thing, now he has this huge weapon of destruction. And before you even land a hit on him, you have to take out all of those cannons that all have different uses. The one at the bottom fires a laser, the one at the top fires a bouncy laser, the second one from the bottom shoots a tracking, a homing laser, whatever you want to call it. Uh, so you're going to want to take them out, but when you destroy one, just like that, he'll, in, he'll inch closer to you until you only have two platform. He'll, he'll kind of squish your platforms until you only have two platforms left. Now the second one from the top, it shoots like a little boomerang thing. I mean, you can see it for yourself, so you should know. So now we only have two net left to go. So charge up while you're not being shot at, and then release your double charge shot as you are uh, closer to the cannon things. Uh, Sergius can only fire the cannons when he's right next to them, so that's a good, good uh, cue. So how do you know? So next, now we can finally touch Sergius. But he'll fire out these little balls of light, laser light, whatever, and they'll split into uh, the four directions, up, down, left, and right, or they'll be diagonal. Hor horizontal, vertical, and diagonal. But every other sw shot it switches, and I almost got killed by the spikes there. So I believe his weakness is the fire speed burner whatever <laughs> and uh yeah it's you just gotta dodge those things and then try to shoot him not the little carrier thing but this boss might take a while to complete so just kind of wait for it i guess but at this point, it's really important to remember that it switches every other, every other shot. The uh, vertical, horizontal, and diagonal. Diagonal. Yep. Diagonal. Just keep shooting him, and he's oh, barely down to half health, and I used three sub tanks already. But we 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 should get him any any time now. Just a little bit longer. Oh man. If I jump on the spikes right now. all this all this work I do wonder what's on the other end of that spike of that uh, area with the spikes there though I mean is there is there like a wall or something or is it just break there I mean boundary break please <laughs> this is impossible the prophecy must be fulfilled but prophecy there's a prophecy there's something bigger. Oh, that's Sergius, and that is all that we can do today. So, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe to see more, and uh, see you in the next video when we take on X Hunter Stage 3 and the Boss Rush. Um, yeah, that's it. Peace. 
Oh, and cheap.